being broken, thinking something's gotta give. This is real life. That was a very bad first kill at Araxi in about a month. I forgot to change my prayers, which was terrible. And then also I forgot one of the potions, which help um, give you more adrenaline. So at least I killed it. Let's see what I get for the first loot. And it's pretty bad. Uh, so I'm going to have to change my prayer real quick. And then... I should be able to easily kill this. I think this t that kill took like 11 or 12 minutes or something, so it was pretty shitty. I forgot that this was my Reaper task, so got 20k slur XP and 20 Reaper points, and we got shit loot. First good drop at Araxi, we got two uncut onyxes, and besides getting a spider leg piece, the onyx is the main drop that I really want to get because it's the most expensive at Araxi. I would say another five kills or six kills later, we got another pair of onyxes, which is amazing. Araxite pheromone, I think that's around two mil still. So I'm going to get two or three more kills in this trip and I'll do a price check of my current loot tab with Araxi. Finished up with the trip, I would say this price check is going to be for 20 to 25 kills at Araxi. I might be completely wrong with that, honestly. I don't really keep track of how many kills I do for these price checks, and I just kind of guess. But with the kills that I do have, 17.1 from the loot so far, and the Onyx is coming out to 8 mil from the 4, and the Pheromone 2.2 mil, like I expected to be around 2 mil. Also, I'm going to take out the Runite Ore and the Runite Bars that I got from the Harmonized Runite Ore for Tra Hour. So I would say that's maybe four hours of runite ore mining, and that totals out to be 24 mil. So the runite ore, 5.3 mil, and then the bars, around 2 mil. Forgot about my herbs as well. So I've been doing a lot of herb runs and almost 1,000 toe flex. And then I did a little bit of the blood weed herbs. I stopped because it's kind of annoying to do that herb patch without the wilderness diary completed. So it's uh, it takes a while to get there. And with the price check with everything that I have so far for this video, 30 mil, which is going to be very helpful for whenever I do go for 120s or if I need more armor for upgrades and stuff, which I plan on getting upgraded armor before going for another 120, I think. Uh, I need to get the rest of the Serenic armor because the Death Lotus I'm using, I mean, that's good. I get the kills, but I think when I get the full set of Serenic, my kills will be 10 times faster, hopefully. Fingers crossed for that. I'm not real sure how much of a difference that armor actually makes. So I'm going to get that more than likely maybe in another episode or two because uh, I don't know how much it is. I think it might be like 40 mil for the top and bottom. So might be a little bit too expensive for me right now. And then all I need currently is just the middle leg piece, as you can see in my bank. And unfortunately, you know, I got those two eyes kind of annoying, but I'm going to have to deal with it, obviously. And the price check for the staff is 149 mil. So, you know, it's decent. But then the scythe, 275 mil. I'm kind of thinking about just waiting to get the uh, fan piece to make the scythe whenever I get the middle leg piece. Or do I just make the staff whenever I get the middle leg piece? I really don't know. The third pair of Onyx right there, easy for mil. The last price check I did was 15 days ago. So we're going to do another one real quick. And I'm going to show you the kill count I have currently, which is 95, very close to 100. Obviously, fastest kill is still 6 minutes and 51 seconds. And recently, my kills have been like 7 minutes, low-ish 8 minutes. And it's currently on like the easiest path rotation right now, which is path two and three for me. Still hunting for the middle leg piece since that is the only one I need to get so I can make a staff. And I kind of hope I get a the fane so I can make the scythe because that's like 250 mil. So kind of hope I get the fane and then the middle leg piece. But if I don't, I'll just make the staff, I guess. So let's do a price check. And the total amount is 41 mil. 13 mil just from the onyxes, 3.6 mil with the scales, 6 mil with runite ore. I did a good amount of the harmonized ore. I think maybe three hours, I would say. So not that much, but it does add up. 7.3 mil just doing herb runs. And then the pheromone. And then let's see what else. 
and then some magic seeds 1.3 mil almost 1.4 mil and some of these hydric bolt tips and other than that pretty decent amounts from everything else i got from araxi except the dwarf weed seeds i hate getting those and uh yeah 41 mil on top of 1.7 mil it's gonna be close to 43 mil so i'm gonna sell this real quick I'm gonna put my cash in the bank and gonna sell all this and see how much money i do actually get everything sold 40 mil and then let's get the money in my bank real quick i don't know where it went get it out wait i had money in here <laughs> okay well i had 1.7 mil in my coin pouch and then i have some money in the bank for some reason not sure why but it's 42 mil and it's to be exact 42.9 mil extremely close to 43 mil so that is a very successful episode oh wait it's gonna be more than 43 mil in seconds get 9k natures out i've been doing the wicked hood daily i'm gonna keep some because i need some for the viswax the uh rune goldberg machine thing bob and let's just put this in the ge i guess instead of just doing a price check and that's 3.5 mil just from doing that daily and we're up to 46 mil now did i forget anything else I don't think so if I do then it's whatever so 46 mil in the episode for today very successful like I mentioned already and I'm gonna be I think I'm gonna save this money up a little bit I know I'm gonna have to buy a drinking pickaxe eventually which I'll do maybe in a, a little bit today or in a couple days whenever I go back to mining but that will be it for this episode. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure to leave a like on the video. You can subscribe for more RuneScape 3 content. You can follow my Twitter. The link is always down below. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace.